Hi everyone, in the front of me I've got Motorola Moto G32 and let me show with you how to check the total screen time on this device. So first of all, let's enter the settings and here we have to scroll down to the very very bottom to find digital well-being and parental controls. And as you can see, we will have this graph which will show us for how long we've been using this device today. If you cannot see it, no worries, and probably you will have to pick between the well-being and the parental controls, so simply tap on uh, the first option. So. Um, as I said, we've got this graph and we've got two different ways to check some further details. Of course, as you can see, you've got also the unlocks and the notifications count. So you can tap inside this graph and you will be transferred to the dashboard, which will show you the time you've spent on the kind of full screen. So the screen time in particular days of the week, as you can see, you can swipe and check. Um, you can change the screen time to the notifications received and times opened. And under it, you've got all of the apps listed with the time you've spent on them. So this is the first way and the second one is to tap directly on the app. So for example, in my case, the settings phone on the or the Chrome. So let me pick the settings because I've spent most of the time on, on it. Um, and again, we've got this dashboard. However, this time it's just slightly connected with the settings. So you do not have any uh, further details about other apps. You've got only about the settings. Again, you can change the screen time to the notifications and the times opened and here from daily to hourly. So basically, this is the whole point of checking the, um, the screen timeout. However, um, just a quick disclaimer about the ways to disconnect, because as you can see, we've got this cool but timeout and the focus mode. Basically, um, if you need the time for yourself, if you want to rest, if you need to work, um, basically, if you don't want to be disturbed, I highly recommend to set, for example, the focus mode or, or the bedtime mode, because here you will be able to pick some distracting apps, so probably like social media, etc. And you will be able to set the schedule. So let's pretend the camera is the most distracting app for me. And you can set the schedule so you can pick particular days and the hours in which your device will simply hide the notifications from uh, chosen apps and thanks to this you will not be disturbed so you can uh, focus and you can work etc all right so uh that would be all thank you so much for watching i hope that this video was helpful and if it was please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up